Hi, welcome to Azure Everyday with Primatic Works. My name is Steve Hughes, and I'd like to talk to you a little bit today about uh, Azure Database for MySQL. Microsoft recently released to GA their platform as a service option for MySQL called Azure Database for MySQL. MySQL is a first class citizen on Azure? Sure thing. Microsoft is using their relational data services platform to support multiple relational database platforms, including Azure DW, Azure SQL Database, MySQL, and PostgreSQL, and soon MariahDB. So why should you consider Azure Database for MySQL for your application? If you use MySQL with your application, whether it's with WordPress, PHP, Django, or other open source development platforms, you have a great new opportunity to move your platform to Azure with web apps and your database to MySQL. Here are five key things that make Azure Database for MySQL a great choice for your open source solution. First of all, no installation required. This is a platform as a service solution you can turn on in Azure just like Azure SQL Database. Go in, turn it on, use it. Azure Data, data Services, number two, Azure Data Services secure, is secures data by default. Your MySQL database is encrypted at rest by default. The backups are also encrypted. MySQL database also has multiple compliance certifications, including HIPAA and high tech for medical data and PCI DSS level one for personally identifiable data. Go check out the Microsoft Trust Center for more information about what else, uh, what other certifications have already been applied to it. High availability, number three, high availability is built in. Whether you use VMs or AWS, you need to either set up or pay for an additional instance. In both cases, you essentially double the cost of your solution to get high availability for your MySQL solution. Keep in mind that Azure has three copies of the data to protect your solutions from these issues. You can also scale on demand. This is reason four. This will actually let you right-size your database resources rather than only planning for the peak need. Typically, you can reduce what you deploy in Azure and scale up as required, saving you more money from the start. So as you kick off your application, you build it small and grow it as you need to. Fifthly, MySQL native replication is available. You can actually use MySQL native replication. This was re released in May of this year, and you can scale out replication using MySQL, whether it's from another cloud server, on-premises or wherever, you can use native MySQL replication to scale across cloud and cross uh, platform as you need to. This adds another option to support a migration as well. When you're looking at migration, you can actually migrate and then switch which one is the data in primary node. Overall, using Azure Database for MySQL is designed to support your open source solution from the ground up. One last thing to keep in mind is that Microsoft has committed to using the community edition and not forking a custom version so you can migrate with ease and confidence. This is a key thing because they don't plan to customize MySQL for Azure. Instead, they plan to support MySQL Community Edition on Azure. So if you have more questions about using Azure Database for MySQL or other Azure and open source opportunities on the Azure platform, click the link below for more information. We'd be happy to reach out and, and talk to you about this. Thank you for listening and have a good day.